why did we use a new variable g instead of simply calling this one uh, variation in the stock well these two are the same if there is no harvesting but uh, if uh, uh, there is harvesting the variation of the stock will be in general uh, different and uh, in particular if we are in a certain point and uh, we 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 harvest what is exactly equal to the grow uh, uh, produced by the resource compatible with with that point of stock where we are. Of course, the uh, um, the, the the stock doesn't change, so we have uh, a sustainable harvesting in the sense that uh, the variation of the stock. Uh, uh, remain remain at zero and in particular for each level of harvesting uh, that is below the, the maximum we'll have uh, two different point of uh, sustainable harvesting in this case in this chart s1 and s2 s1 and s2 what's the the difference between them well we saw this case, uh, you may have saw this case in an uh, exercise, but let's go to, to analyze it together. First, let's, let's uh, see how the variation in the stock is given by the growth of the resource less what it is harvesting. And if you want a, a steady state, a sustainable steady state where the stock doesn't change, of course, this must be equal uh, to, to zero. From here, we replace G with uh, its uh, uh, equations and we solve by S. We end up that with an with, uh, uh, equation in, uh, of a second order where the two, um, the two roots are S1 and S2 equal to B over 2, that is the, the center, plus or less this value. So one of these uh, uh, equilibrium point will be on the right and one will be on the on the on the on the left. This as I said that these two equilibriums are not the same or ever. Let's see S1. If I am on S1, what happens if I is, uh, if my real stock is not S1 but is is S1 comma okay i am here the resource regenerate this amount but i am harvesting this amount not this one so i am harvesting more than what the resource produce if i continue to harvest the same amount the next moment in time i will have another level of stock even lower but if i continue to harvest this amount as you can see that more and more uh, time pass if I remain with a uh, harvesting level that is uh, 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 the same and uh, I started with a situation where the stock was a little bit lower than the stock that is comparable or compatible with my harvesting level my stock reduce, reduce further and further till arriving to zero. Conversely if I my initial level of stock was a little bit higher so it was s1 double comma this is how much the resource could generate but i do harvest only here so i harvest a little bit less than what the resource regenerate and hence in this case the stock move in this sense on over the right and more and more increase 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 so this equilibrium is not stable because it is stable only if I harvest exactly the, the amount compatible with, with the stock level. Let's see instead with the equilibrium on the right side. This equilibrium is, is, is stable because if I start with another uh, level of stock. So I'm still harvesting this amount of, uh, of, uh, of uh, resource, but I am with, uh, with this amount of stock, S2, comma. Well, if I am in these situations, the resource produce 
this amount I'm harvesting this one so there is uh, a little bit over production here over production of the resource that is not uh, uh, harvested it means that the next moment in time my resource will move to uh, the right it will increase its stock so when it does that it will produce but this time it will the, the, the difference will be lower and uh, it will move again on the right till arriving to my uh, my original point and the same if i start from uh, from a level of stock higher than uh, than s2 for, for example here s2 comma it will move over the equilibrium so in uh, the the case of this equilibrium comparable with, compatible with my harvesting on the uh, left side of the of the of the half is uh, uh, unstable while the uh, equilibrium point on the right side is stable let's now going to study the harvesting production function and in particular let's going to assume that uh, uh, the harvesting output that a harvesting firm is able to obtain from our natural resource depend from both the stock of the resource and the effort that the firm uh, put to obtain uh, uh, the output and in particular we are going to make some assumptions uh, uh, that are uh, uh, pretty um, reasonable that uh, increasing uh, the, the effort will lead to higher output but also increasing the stock lead to higher output that is that uh, if uh, uh, our fisheries has a, a larger amount of fish at the same level of effort it is easier uh, to obtain a higher amount of uh, output we can given these uh, these assumptions we can use the implicit function theorem to conclude that also the um, marginal effort of the stock at uh, uh, equal level of, uh, of output is, is negative and uh, the implicit function you I just recall you that f of x when f of x and y is equal to zero we can find the relative uh, uh, differentiate for example the dy over the x as minus of the implicit functions for x over the, the derivative of the implicit function for y. So here we can apply the uh, implicit functions and because both these two are positive so end up that uh, uh, this one is negative and it's pretty obvious. So if the harvest if the output is, is constant if we increase the uh, amount of stock in, uh, in our if the stock in our resource increase the effort we have to do to obtain the same level of, uh, of, of output is uh, lower if the resource is under open access harvesting could uh, lead to over exploitation of the resource a problem that is known in the literature as tragedy of the commons and let's see why if we chart uh, uh, so in on this axis the stock and on the same axis the the but on the opposite side the effort such that here we have a effort equal to zero and here we have the maximum effort needed to completely uh, uh, harvest all the populations and uh, let's assume that the cost, uh, uh, the marginal cost for unit of effort uh, C is, is constant. So this line then CI represents the total extraction cost of, of, uh, of, uh, of our uh, effort. And uh, uh, under uh, open access, the problem is that until what you obtain from your harvesting is higher than how much it cost you you continue to harvest and you arrive hence 
to the point uh, A and without worrying too much of uh, your uh, uh, your effect on uh, of your harvesting or over your population till you can catch something at uh, uh, what you can catch give you more than what it costs you you do that and we see that this uh, level of harvesting is uh, inefficient because uh, uh, we could have get instead uh, with this with a much lower level of of effort the same amount of of harvesting further it is uh, um, an, an unstable uh, uh, equilibrium and if we consider also the problem that some uh, natural resources have the s minimum over which they lead to extinction we see that the uh, natural resource under open uh, access could uh, lead to the complete uh, exhaustion of the resource. When the resource is uh, instead uh, exploited by a single uh, uh, owner of the resource, that is when private property rights are assigned to the resource, the objective of uh, its, uh, its owner will be to maximize the profit his profit that is to maximize the difference between what he obtain uh, as output of the harvesting less the cost of harvesting so he maxim the, the the variable that is free to change is the harvesting level so he maximize over the harvesting level this difference here and so taking the first order conditions he come out that uh, uh, he harvest till the point where the marginal uh, harvesting output by effort is equal to C, the marginal cost. So again, a trade-off between the marginal benefits and the marginal cost. So if we see it in a graphical, this corresponds uh, to this point uh, EC. And uh, we can see that uh, uh, when uh, there is a single owner, the level of harvesting is higher than under uh, free access, and uh, the equilibrium is stable because it's on the right of, uh, of B over 2, and uh, the effort required to obtain the same amount of, ma of, uh, of output that we could have in uh, uh, open access is much lower than EA. Alternatively, we can obtain the same level of, uh, um, of uh, uh, exploitation of the resource uh, that is efficient for a single owner in case of, uh, uh, um, of uh, multiple agents uh, harvesting the resource, but let, letting them pay a, a tax and uh, we can uh, uh, set the this tax uh, considering that the marginal harvesting over the effort must be equal to the marginal cost and then considering that the harvesting as a function of the effort will be in this case equal to the cost plus the tax uh, that multiply the effort and by substitutions here we can find the optimal amount of tax that should we uh, set in order to arrive to the same uh, equilibrium point.